So we are still in the chapter of um, spaces and subspaces and we start this video with a very important theorem the intersection of any number of subspaces of a vector space V is a subspace of V. So if we have a vector space and let us say we have here several subspaces so the intersection of all these uh, subspaces it will be still a subspace of V okay and the proof for this is quite easy to follow so we pick uh, WI um, where I is an I let us pick this set all um, subspaces of what did I call it V okay all subspaces of vector space V so WI where I is in I are all subspaces of vector space V and let us say that W is the intersection of this collection here okay I in I okay so every single double WI is a subspace okay so zero will be here okay for every i in i okay so that's point number one so zero will be here because every single one is a subspace of the vector space okay so um, zero is here already okay now let us pick vector u and vector v and let us say they are here in W. So if uh, not, let us sorry, I wrote plus. I meant U. Let us pick vector U and vector V, both in W. So if they are in W, so uh, U and V will be here in uh, an intersection. Okay for every i in i okay um, now since each w i here every single one is a subspace we have a times u plus b times v vectors they will be in w i okay so this means that a u plus b v is in w okay so w is a subspace f v and this concludes the proof let me just quick uh, remind you the corollary about the um, uh, vector subspaces. We say that W is a subspace of vector space V if and only if 0 is in W or W is not the empty set and 2 for any vectors U and W in W that means that A where A and B will be uh, scalars uh, in the field AV plus BW are, or AV plus BW is in W okay for all A and B scalars in the, the field okay <coughs>